So we're out here this morning working with with Bruno and his reactivity with people. So what we're gonna do is try to engage with a friend and here he's already starting to kind of get a little bit too excited to focus. So we're gonna have him redirect. And starting from a distance, I'm gonna go ahead and say hi. Hi, how you doing? Hey, I'm fine, how about you? Good, good boy, right? Thanks. He's a good looking guy. He, he might bark at you, but we're trying to get him not to. Good boy. So what I'm looking for is watching his body language as well as watching what he's focused on. It's good that he can take focus off of her, right? And then back on to me, hopefully. Bruno. Bruno. Good boy. Very good, good job. Okay. We want we want to do our best to kind of ping pong his attention, especially when he starts to get anxious with somebody new, right? So, good boy. So we're gonna go ahead and get a little bit closer, and we'll continue conversing. Hi, how you doing? Hello. This how is <laughs> this is Bruno. Okay. Yeah, the weather is pretty nice. Yeah. Good boy, Bruno. Good job. How old is he? Uh, he's under a year, I think. He's still pretty young. Yeah. Yeah. Good boy. So you can kind of see he's still pretty tight. Yep. Tail is down, panting. He's almost looking like he's avoiding the situation too. All right. So that's another sign that he's not comfortable and probably shouldn't, the person probably shouldn't push forward and, in, and try to engage either with him or with me because we're so close to each other, right? So I'm gonna go ahead and put myself, uh-uh. Oh. Well, I was thinking of trying to put myself in between, but he's gonna move forward too. So mm -hmm. we'll go ahead and stay back. It was good that he, it was good that he disengaged as quickly as he did, but still it was bad that he engaged at all. all right? So the next time that he does that, we're going to have to correct him with the leash. So that way he doesn't, uh, doesn't scare anybody. Good boy. Yes, good boy. Stay. Good boy. Very good. How's your hand? It's doing better. Oh. The therapy helps a lot. Nice. Good boy. Bruno. Good boy. It's okay. Good boy. So what we'll do is we'll try to walk together for a little bit. I'm going to keep him on the outside of me. Um, there we go. And we'll try to, to walk and talk okay. and get Bruno used to being closer to somebody as well as hearing their voice without actually without a hard engagement. No good. Good boy. Thank you. a busy neighborhood this morning. Yeah. Lots of people walking their pups. <laughs> There's a lot of dogs in this neighborhood. We we're all talking about how it would be nice once they we get a dog park in the area. Yes. You said they were putting one in in Stafford, right? Yeah. It should be done, I think, in October. So. Oh, that's, it's imminent. Yeah. Uh-uh. Good boy. Good. So there, when you know he looks at somebody and growls, it's going to usually be a request for space, right? But we don't want uh, 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 we don't want our our friend to move away, right? Even though that's the thing that you know normally you should do. We're not doing it though because we don't want to teach him that if he is uncomfortable and growls at somebody, they'll move away, right? Okay. We we need to teach him that he shouldn't growl at somebody that's not doing anything to make him uncomfortable, right. right? Because our friend here is just walking and talking with us. There is no threat. So we really need to, we really need to um, get him adjusted, right? As opposed to um, letting him kind of get, get his way and go with his insecurities. Right. And that's, that's gonna be really difficult. Oh, sorry. <laughs> that's gonna be really difficult for uh, a lot of people 
right? Because like I said, it's gonna be natural. And for the most part, if a dog growls at you, <laughs> you yeah. should move away. <laughs> and this is gonna definitely be one of those instances. Oh, hold on, we're gonna. Okay. What we're trying to do right now is just get him used to being around somebody new and listen to their voice without him actually engaging with the person directly. So you can kind of see now he's a little bit more relaxed. He's checking in on the person, but he is also looking away and walking away, right? And that's good. We want him to have the opportunity to kind of make the space on his own so he can feel comfortable as opposed to growling at somebody and then making them move, okay. right? It's a lot more appropriate this way, if he's uncomfortable with somebody, he moves away. He moves away versus moving me away. Right. Good boy. Yes, good job. <laughs> good boy. He is one very pretty boy. He is a good guy. And what I'll try to do now, and he's not paying too much attention, and I'll still stay close by, but I'll give you the leash while well, I try to. I know he's not going to be the, the best one. Ah, good boy. No, uh, uh, no. Right? So, as soon as he gets close and tries to snap at somebody, we have the anti bark collar on to let him know that he can't do that either, and we'll pull him away. Good boy. Yes, I know. Good boy. <laughs> right? That is a good boy, Bruno. Right. Yeah, I know your name too. So, again? Might have to actually, yeah, let's not put it in that hand. Oh, yeah. yeah. I'll still help you out a little bit too. Okay. Come on, big guy. I'll let you kind of walk. Good boy. Uh -uh. Good boy, come on. There you go. Good boy. We'll work you together, together okay? Good boy. We'll walk you together. Good boy. There you go. Good. This is good because he's looking and he's disengaging as opposed to yeah. freaking out and engaging. Good boy. Good boy. Yeah. And it didn't take it didn't take too long. It definitely still took a couple. Good boy. Yes. Good. There you go. Oh, oh we're good. We're good. Good boy. Good boy. Uh, uh, uh. No. Uh, uh. No. So this is the part where we actually have to correct him, right? So if yeah. he goes in, he jumps like that, he gets he definitely gets a correction to let him know that that behavior is inappropriate, right? She's not doing anything wrong. He is. So in these cases, he does get corrected. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. And then we try again. All right. We're going to be friends yet, Bruno, right? Good boy. Uh-uh. Boy. We don't have to overly correct him or be too harsh but we have to let him know as soon as that happens as soon as he does that that it's that it's inappropriate right and the reason why we're we're staying like ah, uh -uh. boy good job there we go the reason why we're staying so close is because this is where he needs the most practice good boy yeah is he a good boy good job right we have to present the opportunity for him to fail, unfortunately, and that's why you want to be close and be ready to pull him away from your friend or whoever you're practicing with, right, to correct him too. But he needs this situation, right? He's got to be, he's got to be in the most uncomfortable position for him. So that way we can teach him that there's no reason to be uncomfortable in this situation. So he has to live in this good boy until he's okay with it. Good yeah, boy. Good job. Yes, hello. Good boy. Yes. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Good boy. Yeah. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Oh my God. Okay. All right, we try again. And that's all. Oh, I wasn't facing the camera. Good boy. So once again, if he overreacts, we just correct him. We try again. Good boy. Yes. yes. Very good. That was nice. If he looks and just disengages, we'll give him praise, right? Because this is what he needs. To get comfortable, good boy. Oh my, yes, he had a hard time deciding on that one. Uh huh. 
at least if you're paying you know attention at all it's it's pretty obvious right he he will focus on the person and if his body stays stiff he will he will overreact mm -hmm. uh, there we go. all right good boy you're okay uh -uh. all right we'll have to, we'll head back to to your car now good boy What do you think of all this, Bruno, huh? Slow down. This is stressful for you, I know. I'll go ahead and pet him until he's distracted, and we'll let you try as well. I'll go ahead and hold on to him. You want me to pet him? Yeah, go ahead. Good boy. Good job, Bruno. Hello. Uh -uh. I'm not looking in your eyes, no? Uh-uh, no. No. Uh-uh. 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 Thank you. Uh-uh. Good boy. Can you walk some more, Bruno? Go ahead and try to pet him again, because okay. I'm going to be ready to correct him here. Uh-uh, no. Good job, Bruno. It's okay. Oh, my goodness. I'm sorry. I'm it's okay. No. So the reason why, right, is when you're looking at him, and you'll see in the video, you can tell in his eyes that he's scared, right? Oh. So at least he was able to accept it for a while. But that's another thing that you'll, you'll want to look for right when he's engaging with somebody as if like i said he's he's scared or unsure or hesitant he's all of those things right now when we're trying to push the the boundaries for him right. go ahead and do it one more time okay just me, Bruno. good on and then off close that's right we'll try again tell me when give him a, i'll give him a second okay. but boy it's okay it's okay okay go ahead on off Good. See, it's okay. Good boy. There you go. <laughs> On. Off. Good boy. See, it's okay. It's okay. Good boy. On. Good boy. Good. Good boy. Off. Good. Good boy. There you go. Uh-uh. Yes, good boy. Good job. Good boy. All right, on. Uh -huh. Shh, it's okay. Shh. <laughs> it's okay. On again. It's okay. Good boy. Good boy. It's okay. Give him a little bit of a break. Yeah. Good boy. It's okay. All right. And then on again. Good. Small movements. There you go. Good boy. Good. Good. Go ahead. Off. Good boy. We'll walk a little bit. Uh-uh. All right. All right. And then on. Off. There you go. And then on. Good boy. Oh. Uh, come on. There you go. All right. Let's try again. All right. We'll go ahead and keep walking. Good boy. It's okay. It's okay. I know. It's okay. <laughs> All right. Go ahead and back on. Good boy. Wish this wasn't falling down either. All right. Good twist. boy. There you go. Okay. And then back on. It's okay. Back on. Good. There you go. Good boy. Good boy. Shh. Trying to get him to refocus on me a little bit. Mm -hmm. And calm down. There you go. Good boy. Okay. Okay. Now just go on and off in uh, short successions, really gently. 
So just disengage, re-engage. Good. And then just do it harder and harder until you're in normal petting. You feel his heartbeat. Good boy, there you go. Good. Good boy. Now something like this, in a normal situation with somebody, you'll want to take about maybe five times as long. Right? We are accelerating the process to help get him used to being comfortable in an uncomfortable situation. But this is definitely something that you shouldn't rush. Right? You'll want to take your time with. Because once he does get comfortable with somebody, then you're okay. Right? But it'll, it'll, take, it'll take him time for that. But we need to continuously present the opportunity and make it so he doesn't feel like it's okay to overreact, right? And we also need to correct him when he does, but we, uh, we can definitely give him praise and give him pets and give him treats and give him all the love in the world when he's remaining nice and calm when a stranger's petting him. Good boy, good boy. All right, go ahead and disengage. Come on, let's go. It was nice to see him lie down and relax for a sec. He's tired. He said he's, this is definitely stressing him out, uh -huh. right? Good boy. Go ahead and re-engage. Good boy. Good boy. There you go. Good job. Very nice. Good boy. Good. But not too bad. Definitely a few corrections. But not too many. Nothing too extreme. So barking is down. We're at like 12 minutes. Plus maybe a little bit before we started. And then I had to pause because of his bathroom break. So maybe 15 minutes. It's not, it's not bad. Like I said, this is definitely accelerated. I would slow this process down maybe half an hour to an hour to an hour and a half with anybody new for him. Good boy. All right, go ahead and disengage and walk. It's okay. Good, there you go, good. Good. All right, go ahead and re-engage. Oh. That's good. Good boy. Oh my goodness. And then just try to continue to talk to me too if you can. Uh-huh, all right. It's okay. So, good boy. You should have seen Flint yesterday. Oh yeah, how's yeah. Flint doing? He's doing really well. That surgery hasn't slowed him down one bit. That's good. He um, jumped off the deck yesterday. Oh wow. On the benches. Not from the regular deck level. How's he say? Good boy. Coming back up the deck, he went underneath the bench but over the deck. Oh, sounds like quite the athlete, athlete over there. He can do when he wants. Good boy. All right, good. Go ahead and disengage. All right. Good boy. Oh, there we go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Where was he heading? Uh, away. Good boy. <laughs> I know. Good boy. Oh, look at that set. Right. Yep. So what we'll do now that he is a little bit more comfortable is we will re-engage with her like we normally would. So I'll let you stand over there and I'll come and say hi to you. Okay, I'll go over here. And we're just gonna, we're gonna check to see how he is, right? So we're gonna, we're gonna let him go with us, All right? Hi, how are you doing today? Oh, just fine. What a gorgeous day. Oh right, yeah. What a gorgeous day. It is pretty nice out, huh? Yeah. Yep, it sure is. Who do you have with you today? Oh, this is Bruno. Hi, Bruno. Good boy. Good boy. Yeah, he's beautiful. He's a good guy. Yeah. Good boy. Excellent. You know me a little bit now? Very good. <laughs> Very good. good. Yeah, good, good boy. Good boy. It's nice to see that. Yeah, we're gonna go ahead and end on a good note here with his interactions. Good boy, <laughs> very good. He's he's definitely really tired. It doesn't seem like a long time, but because he's under stress the entire time, it can be really exhausting for 
for an animal so I'm gonna go ahead and give him a break and we're gonna do more exercises like this hopefully when we find some more willing volunteers <laughs> so thank you very much for all of your help oh sure all right, good boy Absolutely. what a good boy you are Bruno